it's Angela here again today welcome back to my channel um, very warm welcome if you are new and of course if you're one of my long-standing sub subscribers um, a virtual hug and a very warm welcome to you as well now today um, I've got a bit of a flip through of a swap um, journal that I did with Susanna Easdale um, now Susanna um, has created a beautiful um, journal for me from a book that I've been watching her do on her um, channel, Vintage Studio. I'll put all the links in the description box for you um, on an antique book. Now, um, I've just received it in the post and I've just read Suzanne's card, which is lovely. Thank you, Susanna. Um, and this book is the beautiful, uh, a beautiful book called The Honourable Mr. Tornish. Um, and it was actually, I think it's over 100 years old. So I thought I'd share this with you um, because it's some lovely work that Susanna has put together. She actually has um, the various steps of how she did this on her channel. So you could watch the whole process, which I did as well. So I'm going to share this quickly with you. Um, and of course, I will be making a journal for Susanna as well um, in the future. So thank you as well. I haven't opened this yet. I've just taken off the sellotape um, and Susanna sent me these beautiful pink floral pack. So she must do these in her shop. And I know she's got an Etsy shop. Um, so wow, just a quick look at these. <gasps> Oh my gosh, and you do know I love pink, Susanna. Um, thank you, this is so lovely. Oh my goodness, look at these little motifs. Oh wow, lovely little bits here. I think she's dyed some of these as well. They're all beautiful, various shades of pink. That's lovely, I like little bits. Oh my goodness, so she's cut those out for me as well from lace. Thank you. This is really lovely. Beautiful roses, little flowers. These are lovely. I love this kind of thing, especially when I'm making um, covers or um, clusters or, you know, those kind of beautiful things. So thank you. These are lovely. I love the little bag to keep them all in so I don't lose them. And a little trim here with some little flowers embroidered on beautiful very pretty oh my goodness look at that really pretty i haven't seen anything like that and that's gorgeous as well beautiful trims thank you so generous no need to have done all of that susanna but very much appreciated i think she's avocado dyed this isn't that lovely that's beautiful. Can you imagine a lovely pocket or something with that? Really pretty. Oh my gosh, this is lovely. So fine. Oh, beautiful. I'm sure this must be an antique as well. They don't make it that, that fine anymore. Beautiful lace. Oh, there's another little leaf and that goes in there. Um, beautiful lace netting. Oh. Oh my goodness, and a lovely doily with, look at that embroidery. She's dyed that. That is phenomenal. I love that. Thank you so much, Susanna. You have really spoilt me. That is unbelievable. Now we've got some gorgeous pages here. Something you guys don't know about me, I am a history um, freak as well. I love history and I love learning about how people lived in different areas and decades and centuries. Um, so I'll probably end up reading this before I use it. <laughs> so that must come from some kind of a magazine. Oh, look at that. There's a whole story going on here. Low in a low place. A Russian peasant girl. Russian life. The peasant girl. Her home. I'll definitely be reading this. Thank you, Susanna. That's lovely. Those are great pages for your journal. Oh my goodness. Look at that. These are lithos. That's amazing. Oh my goodness. 
beautiful book. I remember her showing some of these, um, and I think there are some in the actual book itself. We'll get to it. That is stunning. I love those, and I do love this too. Isn't that gorgeous? Wow. So pretty. I'll have to save that for my own journal. I just love that. That is gorgeous. Thank you. <gasps> Wallpaper. That's a vintage page. Love that. Some wallpaper. Definitely all up my alley. Love that. That's beautiful. And that. That's stunning. Oh, you've got lovely wallpapers as well. Oh my goodness, we've been spoilt and I haven't even got to the book yet. Susanna, thank you so much. This is really so very kind of you. Right, now I'm going to focus on this book. Um, and I love this book when she, Susanna showed the book. Um, because obviously I am an English teacher. Well, and maths, but English. Um, and I do love a good book. <laughs> and I don't have any altered books so this is really beautiful i love this cover isn't that amazing and that picture it really looks vintage it looks like it's a hundred years old but it's in good nick it's beautiful and she's put corners on there and look at the spine isn't that pretty beautiful and she's used uh the traveler's notebook elastics in there that is really a lovely book Wow, so let's get, make sure this is in frame. Um, and now I can show you inside. So we open it up and we have a beautiful pocket here in pink on some gorgeous, I'm sure she said that was Laura Ashley wallpaper. Oh, there we go. Vintage Blend Studio, Suzanne Easdale. All right, so I'll put the link for her YouTube channel. Um, in the description box below and you can all have a look at that and we've got this so I, I love that that's beautiful it goes so nicely with the cover beautiful pocket that she's made look there's a little heart pocket in there and there's a pocket in there with a lovely tag beautiful pink lovely image love that um, and here oh this is the actual front cover from the page 1913 107 years old this book is isn't that unbelievable and she's decorated with these uh tumult stars and these beautiful little butterflies look at that i love the little lines to show me how they've been flying so that's absolutely stunning oh wow so we've got this lovely um flip out over here and that she's laid up with some beautiful wallpaper and die cuts and it's got a little window with a butterfly sticking out and another pretty very pretty tag beautiful with a butterfly on the top oh yes love it so that goes in there and then we've got another butterfly here oh i do love all the butterflies a lovely page which she's used mixed media on um some stamping really pretty um, and this is oh I think this is Scottish Gardens from Antique Papery really pretty love that kit some beautiful fine delicate lace on the end there a lovely page that I think she's coffee dyed and stamped and stenciled beautiful lovely stamps and love your staining Oh, another beautiful page. Oh, I love this wallpaper. Really, really pretty. Oh, and I remember you said when I was watching that um, you live in Victoria. So that's a, a part of the map over there. I'm just going to close the door because I can hear the neighbours. Okay, so yes, this is part of where you live. I remember you said, um, I can't remember if you said you circled it somewhere. This is another one of those um, 
antique papery pages so pretty beautiful really pretty that's lovely as well love this pink it's avocado dyed i think beautiful oh this is a beautiful book as well that you got this is from a, a, a vintage book trying to take it all in Susanna trying to take it all in so sorry if I'm going a bit slowly um, I'll speed it up a bit I can always oodle over it afterwards um, another gorgeous page from that collection love these I love the combination of the dark and the light and the various pages that she's used oh my goodness just look at that isn't that stunning that is gorgeous it's a litho and that's from a, a another antique book this is so pretty too love the blue and that's gorgeous beautiful really beautiful job Susanna, I really am in love with it. It's so pretty. It's always lovely to get journals that other people have made, isn't it? Really lovely. So pretty. On the other side of the map. Oh, there she said. There she circled where she stays, which is not far from Mul Melbourne. Melbourne. South Australia, uh -huh. I don't know Australia very well at all. Oh, the ground ivy fairy and this little booklet. Look at that. Beautiful washi tape. And then the greater uh, calendine fairy, I think. Beautiful pages. White bindweed fairy. Oh, that's amazing. Songs of the bee orchis fairy. That is so amazing and that tucks nicely in that tuck spot with a lovely piece of doily and some collaging there and some more of that beautiful wallpaper really stunning really pretty to Dorothy the best and gentlest of sisters the truest and bravest of comrades I dedicate this book isn't that amazing 1913 oh my gosh the paper to this book is amazing as well here we have some more antique papery oh we're on the second signature and that's also from the book i think beautiful more butterflies and a nice tuck spot over there oh she's put my name on look at that that's amazing love that the book is amazing Lovely. Beautiful. Lovely wallpaper. Lots of nice writing space in here. Um, some gorgeous pages. Double delight. I think it's a... Oh, isn't that? I love that's my favorite rose I love those colors with the cream and the pink double delight stunning oh my gosh that's beautiful the royal road to spelling and reading how appropriate <laughs> look at the toes oh bless that is adorable I'll have to test this out in class oh my gosh some of these words we don't even use Deuteronomy I know about that one Triglyphic, good heavens. I'll have to look some of these up. A lot of them are to do with maths. Pyrolatry, oh my goodness. Oh, look at that, that's my favorite. Oh my gosh, just look at that color. Stunning, really beautiful. That is a beautiful book. Beautiful. Love the stenciling. Love the colours. Love your choice of papers. Oh my gosh, another beautiful vintage page. Really pretty. So pretty. You've got beautiful pages and books 
Susanna, I really love what you've done. More double delight. Isn't that so pretty? This is so girly, so me. Um, you've really captured the essence of me in here and what the kind of things that I enjoy. This is an old vintage photo frame with another beautiful butterfly in there. I think that's from um, Edith Holden. Love that. Beautiful colours. The pinks and the blues in here are just to die for. Really lovely. Thank you so much, Susanna. This is really gorgeous. Really gorgeous. Oh, and we're on to the back page. And she's got... This is very nice. So we've got a little um, ticket over there. We've got a little bag over there. So that's the bottom of the bag as a tuck spot. How clever is that? And she's stuck on some paper and she's put in another gorgeous little tag in there. And we've got this beautiful page and that covers that page. Oh, it comes up like that. And then she's got another thing in this envelope. Look at that. It's a flip out. That beautiful paper with a embossed rose so that goes in there so you can make some secret notes all my secrets are going in there there we go beautiful oh, that's a lovely page too oh, look at all the snippet roll going on here all these beautiful buttons and a little key and beads. Oh my gosh, sequins. There's all sorts of beautiful things. That's so pretty. The Song of the Red Clover Fairy stuck on some fabric here and a little poem. Oh my gosh, I love these fairies. The Wild Rose Fairy. And these are from the proper books. These are really lovely. Oh my goodness, just beautiful. Honeysuckle. She's put all the songs in. I hope. Uh, does that mean I need to sing them? <laughs> I don't want to uh, shock you all with that. Uh, and then a beautiful tag, which I think is wallpaper as well. So that's a really lovely little book. Remember she said she'd made a few of those and that went well, and it does. That's gorgeous. So that slides into there. So there we have it, everybody. That was the lovely swap from Susanna Easdale. And she's from Vintage Blend Studios. So I will put the link in the bottom there. Susanna, this is a beautiful book. Um, I'll cherish it. Thank you so much for doing this for me. Um, I'll try and get on to yours as soon as I can. Um, I'm behind, <laughs> as I told you. Um, and I'll definitely um, put this in my special journal collection there. And on a, a really just amazed by what you've created here it's so pretty so girly so me and it's just lovely thank you so much i love it and i hope that you all go over and show susanna some love on her channel she's got some lovely ideas and um, tips and techniques for you to have a look at there so thank you everybody for sharing that with me today i hope you've enjoyed what you've seen as well and um, stay tuned because I'll have another video up for you very soon. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.